What's going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new Clash Royale video. Sorry for missing two uploads. I had webcam troubles but I finally sorted as you can see. But today I'm coming back at you with this giant minor deck which is triple spell. It's got the mini peck and musketeer and mega minion which makes it super defensive. It's good against bait, it's good against the annoying lava clone and you can use it as a beatdown archetype or a minor chip. So let's jump into a ladder match and see how we do. So let's give this guy some good luck to start out of the match. Fortunately, my Mega Minion is only level 12. But, we'll see how we do. So I've got an okay start in hand. Unfortunately, we don't have Miner, which is probably best start in win condition. So playing, potentially playing Fireball Bait, but I'm going to take it. Let's see. So there's his Ewa. So he's got a level 12 unit as well. Mega Minion won't connect, but then he plays that and then I'm going to play my Giant. So it's going very aggressive. I'm going to have a counter push. So I use the cha uh, Giant to tank, and I'm going to play my Miner to tank for my Musketeer. Place that. Okay. Is that going to connect? Yes. Okay. It's unfortunate. Well played. Good job at one to level 13. Hmm. So. Pretty equal on tower damage. Going to start with Musketeer in the back again. Mini Pekka would be useful against his Lumberjack and Ewers. Okay, I'm just going to take that fireball value. Haven't seen anything else which needs it, so play my mini packer here. Play my mega minion over here. I've got zap ready. Okay, so you place that. Just gonna zap this. Hopefully it doesn't have a miner. Doesn't, okay. Gonna reset with Giant in the back and try to build a nice big push since it is now double elixir. So I'm gonna let that cross and then potentially fireball at the bridge. Like so. Now I'm gonna play my mini pack behind. I'm gonna play minor onto this E Wiz. I'm gonna log. Up. Nice, that's tower down. Hopefully. He's going very, very aggressive there. Need a fireball. Okay. Give him a well played. So I can just mine a chip cycle now, which is the beauty of this deck. Let's up again. I'm going to send Miner in. It's got his Goblin Gang, but okay, predicted that wrong. So we do get some nice chip. Nice. I'm three logs away from winning. Protect this. Play Giant. And we are back to Zap. So we've got Fireball, which does how much? Is it 282? 292. Okay, perfect. Good game. Well played. Nice first start to the match. I love the triple spell aspect. Back inside the second match of the video. So here we are inside our second battle of the video. Let's see. Against an Asian player. I seem to play a lot of Asian players when I play around this time. I wonder what time zones is in there. Like China and Japan right now. So what should we do? Cycle a log. Good thing about this deck is you can cycle your uh, spells fairly good. Still nothing. Okay, there's a knight. Max star level knight. I've got my mini pecker. He's got e drag. Okay. Fireball that. Put my mini pecker here. Happen. They're not going to get anything from this. 
probably lock. Uh, what should I do? Okay, wasn't expecting that. Please die, please die, thank you. Okay, so he just gets two hits from that magic archer. Be good when Bowler gets his uh, rework next season, start of September. And also, if you haven't seen, we're bringing out the um, no draw rule in pretty much every game mode but ladder. So basically, say if the game ended right now, I'd win because I've got the most tower damage on the opponent. Talking too much and not focusing. So what will happen is you'll have like five seconds at the end where the towers will lose damage and basically the first one to hit zero so the one with the lowest or the highest tower damage wins so he's trying to bait out a spell here but i must get to here it's log please I do don't win that interaction though unfortunately well played on his behalf He's got a lot of like defensive troops. Ram Rogers is in condition. So what do we want to do? Nice. Play mine up here. I'm going to zap. Nice. Is that going to be GG's? It is. Good game. Well played. That zap was clutch, and that's the one that won me the game there. Resetting his tower onto my miner is a good trick you can do when using this deck. So here we are against another person who I can't pronounce his name. I do have miner in cycle, which is good. So I'll probably play it onto his tower and then have log ready. No, I won't. I'll play onto the princess. So I'm playing against a bait deck. Okay. Wasn't expecting that. Gonna log at the last possible second. I will log now. Fireball already. Please in time. Thank you. So I'm just gonna get death damage. And then I'm gonna play my miner. Which we are back to. Nice. Steps ready. Okay. So I think we'll do fairly well against this deck. Go good um, Musketeer should get one hit as well. Nice. So we've got Zap for his scam, we've got Log for his Goblin Gang, Princess as well, but well, can use Miner. Okay, so I'm just gonna go giant. Gets one elixir collector down. I can make a lot of positive elixir tra trades with my small spells, so I can ignore that. I think. So there's this princess. I might have to lock this. I think. I will do it again at the last possible second. So it's got Mega Knight. Okay, Mega Knight and Golem. Strange deck. Okay, so I'm gonna have to take that damage, unfortunately. Let's give him a well played there. If I play my Fireball, the Dominion hard, so. Just, just wasn't expecting a Mega Knight, unfortunately. A weird deck that is running. I play my Giant, just a tank, so we've got two Elixir Collectors down, but we're not into double Elixir, so. Play you, then I'm gonna play you here, please. Thank you. Let's get here. Goblin log. Can play Mega Knight, unfortunately. Get my miner down, please. Take it out. Oh, wow. Okay, so I'm going to go giant in the back again. He's probably going to golem at the bridge, I think. Is he? 
Okay, so he opts to play an elixir collector. That might cost him the game. We will see. Play mine now. I know it doesn't help that. Fireball ready. Log. Good game. Well played. That Alexa Collector definitely cost him the game there. We'll do one more battle for the video and then we'll wrap it up. Back inside this third battle, fourth battle, however many. So here we are against French Toast Gang. Weird name. Nice bit of BM early game, level 12. Okay. It's going to cycle Zap to start out. Okay, sarcastic opponent. Go giant in the back. This guy's annoying. So we've got a fireball. Unfortunately, which doesn't die to fireball zap. But she does die to fireball mining. If I can play this right. I don't, unfortunately. We've got executioner. Hmm. Hate it when the uh, tower locks onto the wrong, the wrong thing. Gonna get a ton of damage. Okay. All the damage the executioner gets on the tower is insane. Wow. Okay. Play knee bab, so I really can't lose to this guy. So we'll go giant in the back again to reset. It cycles the zap to equal up the elixir. His own giant, okay. Okay, so, so it's got witch execution at Ebabs. Let's save my mini pecker. For that. Let's go down in time. It doesn't, unfortunately. But we've got a log. Maybe yeah, played the wrong card. That's just mini pack is gonna die unfortunately. We'll go giant in the back. I'll play Muscatine here. And light that witch to cross the bridge. Okay, she does. Give me some nice spell value there. One hit? Nice, okay, okay. Okay, I'm gonna go giant, musky, mini pecker. I'm gonna log here, please take it out. Should have logged the giant. Gonna have to go in very aggressive here. Come on, fireball. Let's give him a laughing face, because he BM does. Cool, one more match, I promise, last match. So here we are inside our final battle against Churi. Spanish player, no minor again, unfortunately. So, yeah. What do you guys think of the uh, reworks that are coming with the no draw rule? Do you think it'll be rolled out on ladder? People say Expo won't suffer, but Expo draws like 20% of the matchups if you look on Stats Royale and things like that. So, I think it'll be tricky for them not to suffer, but I guess we'll see. Plus you can take a tower and then just play super passively and potentially rocket cycle then. Maybe. Okay, that locked onto the wrong thing. Do 
Giant will get a couple of hits. He plays his princess. I've got my log. Nice. So I go musky in the back. Again, I will log at the last possible second. If he plays anything. Okay. Let's go minor on the inside. Eyeball ready. I'm just going to go giant. Probably zap this. Okay. Almost even in tower damage. He's got Musketeer again. He's got his um, Tesla. I'm playing on Mega Minion here. Okay, well played there. Hmm, we're struggling to break through. Play minor, and then play log. Should have delayed on that log a little bit longer. Let me peck her. Hopefully it doesn't have freeze. Nice. So I can go giant in the back. Musketeer, there's his gang. Just ignore that. I'm gonna play my minor onto the Tesla this time round. Or onto the princess actually to tank for the Tesla. So I think we are in minor chip damage now. Play minor again. Now I'm going in the same spot, but... Okay, nice. Mega minion, and let's log. Let's mini peck. Uh... So, fireball wins us a game. Good game, well played. You can see how strong this deck is. Even a noob like me can play it. Slightly above on average on ladder. So till next time guys, thanks very much for checking me out. Peace.